Folklore is rife with terrifying demons lurking in the shadows, preying upon us mere and meek humans. Throughout history various cultures and people have told stories of dark forces, demons pulling strings and corrupting our souls. Some were told to scare children, to lure them away from strangers. Other times the stories came from people who actually worshipped the devil. So today on Top 5 Scary Videos we're going to be counting down the top 5 scariest demons in folklore. Let's jump in. Coming in at number 5, Ronwe. Ronwe, also known as Renove, is a mark and Great Earl of Hell, commanding 20 legions of demons. Whoa, that's quite the feat. Renove teaches art, rhetoric languages, and gives good and loyal servants the favour of friends and foes. Now this dude is straight up evil. He is often depicted as a monster wielding a staff. Not only that, but he is the taker of old souls, often coming to earth to harvest souls of decrepit humans and animals near death. So if you're a fan of your grandparents, parents, aunts, uncles, or people in general, dogs, cats, the neighbours gerbil, perhaps don't summon this cretin into your life. Just a thought. Coming in at number 4, Kelpie. Originating in Scottish folklore, the Kelpie is the name given to the shape shifting water spirits that inhabit the pools of Scotland. They are demons that appear as humans but also take the form of a horse. According to mythology, every lake in Scotland has a Kelpie spirit, even the Loch Ness. Some accounts state that the Kelpie have retained their hooves when appearing as humans, leading to their association with Satan. Now, some have been known to be beautiful, majestic creatures, others are known to prey on humans. Now, these beautiful creatures will kill you, so just like werewolves, Kelpie can be killed by shooting them with a silver bullet. Coming in at number 3, Lilith. Lilith is a demon from the ancient Sumerians and is truly one of the oldest known demons of all time, and that says a lot. Now it's highly debated where she first appeared, some say in the Epic of Gilgamesh, yet she also appeared in Jewish texts around the same time. Lilith is often envisioned as a dangerous demon of the night, with a dangerous sexuality that spawned thousands of other demons. She is sexually wanton and steals babies in the darkness of the night. Not only that, but Lilith may be linked in part to a historically earlier class of female demons in ancient Mesopotamian religion. Coming in at number 2, Krampus. Oh, Krampus. Krampus has seemed to have garnered himself some fame over recent years, with Hollywood releasing a handful of movies about his demonic heinous acts. Popular in Germanic folklore, Krampus in essence is the polar opposite of Santa Claus. His long horns, sharp teeth, and an obscenely large tongue. He is described as half goat, half demon, and on December 5th, each year he comes for all the bad children, capturing them and taking them away from their parents forever, as opposed to his counterpart, Saint Nick, who rewards well behaved children with gifts. And lastly, in the number one, Lucifer. Lucifer, meaning light bearer, is the demon most well known in folklore throughout all cultures. Not only that, but he's arguably the most terrifying. In biblical tradition, Lucifer was one of the seraphim that rebelled against God and was therefore cast out of heaven and into the depths of the underworld. Now, in some cultures, Lucifer is not equal to Satan, but instead rules over Satan, whereas in other cultures, they're both one and the same. In ancient Egypt and Babylonia, there are similar demons called Sata and Zu, both of whom were cast out of heaven as well. Well, well, there we have it. Do you guys agree with our list? Were there any scary demons that we missed? Leave us all your thoughts and feelings in the comments down below. Perhaps we can do a part two. Before we go though, I just want to respond to a few comments from one of our last videos. Katie Derp said, I never clicked so fast. Love your vids. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Aw, thanks Katie. We hope you enjoyed the vid. David Rosales said, another cool video from Queen Lucy. You the girl. Do top five scariest creepypastas. Well, thanks David. Have we not already done that though? I think we have. I'll look into it, but I'm pretty sure we've done that. Also, I can't stand creepypasta, so no. Candice Hensley said, Yay, it's Lucy. I smiled when I saw you were hosting. Oh, thanks so much. I'm glad I can put a smile on your face. And on that note, if you haven't already, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you never miss another scary vid. Until next time, see you later.